hello you are welcome here we want to evaluate this definite integral integral from 0 to 1 x into x squared minus x minus 2 all square dx then from here we can simplify the integral from here the integrand here we have x into x squared minus 2 all squared so here we can simplify this you know algebraic expression first when we square this it means from a minus b square don't forget that this will be a square minus 2 a b then plus b square so when we apply that here this will be x into bracket x square then square which is x raised to power 4 then minus 2 times x square times minus 2 that's minus 4 x square then plus 2 square which is plus 4 then we can now use x to open the bracket and when x multiply again this will be x to the power of 5 then minus 4 x to the power of 3 then plus 4 x so it means we can equally write the integral from here as x to the power of 5 minus 4x cubed plus 4x and therefore we can write the definite integral given again and this will be integral integral from 0 to 1 x raised to power 5 minus 4x cubed plus 4x then dx from here transfer to x then the method of simple method of integration is we you know add one to the power and divide by the power that is when we are integrating x raised to power n with respect to x this is same thing as x raised to power n plus one then divided by n plus one so we add power to this you know we add one to this power and we divide by everything which is n plus one so when we apply that a now we integrate this this give us x to power six then over six that's five plus one then over five plus one that's six x to power six over six then minus four x to power four over four so adding one to this power then divide by the power then plus 4 x squared now already 1 is here and we had 1 again that's 2 then over 2 then we don't need to add plus a constant because we are working with a definite integral so we just put the limit which is the limit is from 0 to 1 then from here we can simplify first before we apply the limit to this so here we still have x to the power of 6 over 6 then minus here 4 cancel 4 x to the power of 4 then 2 go here 1 2 go here 2 we have plus 2 x square then we can now put the limit which is from 0 to 1 here it means that we put we substitute the upper limit first that is anywhere we see x we put 1 then minus substitute the lower limit so we have 1 to power 6 over 6 minus 1 raised to power 4 minus 1 raised to power 4 then plus 2 times 1 square then from here this is the upper limit then minus the lower limit lower limit we put 0 and then when we substitute 0 that's 0 to power 6 <laughs> over 0 everything over 6 then minus 0 to power 4 plus 2 times 0 to power 2 you agree with me that everything here will be 0 so now we have this to deal with now 1 to power 6 is t1 so 1 over 6 that's here then minus 1 then we have plus 2 then this fraction now we can bring it together as one fcm is six then we have 
1 then 6 minus 6 then we have plus 12 which will give us 1 minus 6 that's minus 5 plus 12 that will give us 7 over 6 7 over 6 which of course we can write as one whole number 1 over 6 so here the solution to this integral given to us is simply one number one over six in this particular class thank you for watching please share this video and uh, subscribe to this channel for more exciting videos also don't forget to like and uh, comment if you have any other way of solving this let's have it in the comment section and uh, thank you see you next class and bye